I know what you're thinking. What in the world is an electrostatic speaker? I thought the exact same thing when BenQ offered to send me their Trey Volo S Bluetooth speaker. <sighs> Full disclosure, BenQ was kind enough to send me the speaker for free, but had no input in this review whatsoever. Turns out, electrostatic technology is typically found in higher-end speaker systems. It uses an electrical current to vibrate a thin membrane sandwich between two plates. So what's the main benefit? The technology claims to deliver natural and spacious sound with much less distortion than your conventional speakers. Anyways, you guys don't care about all of that. Bottom line, does this thing sound good? Well, let's unbox it and find out. I was initially thrown off when I first opened the box to find that the speakers are white. I was actually expecting the black ones, but it worked out fine because I actually prefer the white one over the black. Holding and seeing the speaker for the first time, I have to say this is one good looking speaker. The speaker panels actually swing open when you want to use them. And so then when you're done, you can just close them up like this, pack it using this little cute um, curing case that they provide you with, put it inside. <laughs> Here. And seal it, and then you're good to go. But do keep in mind that the speakers do weigh 2.2 pounds, so they are quite hefty. At the top, you have dedicated buttons for play and pause, mode change, volumes up and down, Bluetooth pairing with LED notification, and power with LED notification. The speaker is also NFC compatible. Placing your phone over the end symbol will automatically turn on the speaker and pair it to your phone. Around the back, you have a micro USB port for charging and an auxiliary jack. The Trivolo S includes dual 12 watt woofers, dual amplifiers, and dual vibrant diaphragms. I've been using the Trey Volo S for a little over a week now. BenQ claims an impressive 18 hours of battery life. The first day, I played music on the speaker continuously at a comfortable volume and it gave out around 17 hours. Let's talk about sound. Right off the bat, I'll say this. If you're looking for a table shaking bass, the speaker isn't gonna provide that. Don't get me wrong though, coming from a person that likes to listen to bass heavy music, for me, it does the job just fine. Here's a quick sample. The Trevo OS emphasizes a more balanced natural sound that really shines when you listen to music that features human vocals or acoustic instruments. I kid you not, I'm spending a lot of time listening to vocals, specifically live performance videos of Celine Dion. <clears throat> my heart will go on. And it literally gave me chills down my spine because it felt like I was at her concert listening to her live. I also tested the Trey Volo S while watching some movies and TV shows, and I was able to hear sound effects that I wasn't even aware of before, like footsteps, wind blowing, jackets ruffling. Every single sound was so clear. It literally changed the entire experience. Hitting the mode button on top enables 3D sound, which is said to significantly increase the dimensions of the listening space and immerse you in whatever you're listening to. It's not drastic, but there is a difference. I personally keep it on all the time as it kind of makes you feel like you're right in the middle of everything. I do want to mention that the speaker is unidirectional and emits sound both forward and backwards. Ideally, you want to leave some space behind the speaker so you don't want to leave it up against the wall. To maximize sound stage, position the speaker at ear level, having the wings facing you. Overall, it's a very impressive little speaker that really opened my ears. The $200 price tag gets you a unique design with speaker technology usually only seen in much larger high-end speakers. 
It's not the loudest, but the clarity is the best I've heard from a portable speaker. The bass won't make your heart pound, but it's more than good enough. Although it isn't the lightest, the foldable panels provide great portability, especially when you consider the 18 hour battery life. I'm looking forward to packing this thing for my next trip. I wouldn't hesitate to recommend this to friends or family. I have the links down below in case you're interested in checking out the Travolo S in more detail. As always, thank you so much for watching. Until the next one, peace. Bye.